Hey everybody, so I have a quick tool haul from Home Depot. Today is uh, Friday the 13th, 2020. Um, it is November 13th, so please stick around, check out the video, and I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. Hey everybody, how's it going? Alright, so I picked up some a couple items from Home Depot. Today is November 13th, 2020. Uh, it'll probably be February, March, April or something. Somewhere in there when you see this, guys. But, um... So, I picked up a few things for, you know, during the month of Black Friday. A couple of these items are technically were on discount. So there real quick so I grabbed the 7 inch rafter square and I believe this is the 4 something inch 4 and a half inch and the 7 inch in a kit um, for 14 bucks $14.97 um, I grabbed this Husky three-piece quarter hex impact socket adapter set. These are the 10 inch. Um, the reason I picked those up is because I actually have the six piece, um, which is like the, the three inch and the six inch. Um, and these, I believe are new. I've never seen them before. Um, these were $9.97. Um, I use these style adapters all the time. Um, for small things. This is a mask that I had. Okay, the other item I picked up is the 6-in-1 Milwaukee um, Comfort Grip 6-in-1 pliers. Um, part number 48-22-3079 Yankee. I picked these up. I actually pre-ordered the new 7-in-1s. Um, they'll be here sometime in December. But these were $19.97 instead of the $24.97 they normally are. So a few dollars off helps. I, I believe um, after tax and everything, I believe they ended up being about $24. Bucks. Let me see what the receipt says. Bag out the way. Uh, there was $8 in tax. So... Uh, actually, they were $21. So they're $19.97. Plus $2 for that. Um, $2 for this guy, which is the, the $14.97 for the rafter squares. 4.5 inch and the 7 inch. Uh, the 4.5 inch trim square and the 7 inch rafter square. My apologies. And then $9.88 for the Husky 10 inch extension set. So yeah, there's about $2 in tax on each item, um, including this jacket. So I picked up this um, large Milwaukee jacket. Uh, it's a sweater. It was $49.88. Um, the part number right here is 350B Boy. Lima pullover hoodie black large. Um, I picked this up and uh, don't tell anybody, but uh, I'm gonna mess with my wife. This this is actually not for me. This is this is for my wife. Um, she works in cold environments, um, including coolers and freezers. Um, she tried this on at Home Depot, like three or four weeks ago. She really liked it. Um, and uh, I'm gonna mess with her a little bit. The items that I showed you first are for me. Um, this jacket, I'm gonna cut the tag off and I'm gonna take the sticker off and everything. It is large. Pop the sticker off. Um, I'm gonna put this on when I go to pick her up from work. I'm going to ask her what she thinks of my new jacket. And uh, 
unbeknownst to her, she's probably going to be like all pissed off because, you know, she wanted one. And then I'm going to I'm going to surprise her and I'm just going to give it to her. Um, but it is a nice jacket. I did leave the hanger on it. Um, again, the part number is uh, 350 Bravo Lima. It's a pullover hoodie from Milwaukee Tool. I think it's a nice, I think it's a nice uh, hoodie. Um, I have my my jackets and everything, so I'm not too worried about it. I am gonna put it on, and uh, this is a large. I would normally wear an extra large, uh, you know, and they'll probably rub the cologne I have on off on it, and she'll like it a little more. But uh, so these are the items that I picked up. Uh, it was a total of a hundred and. Two dollars and eighty cents, which eight dollars in tax wasn't bad at all. Um, and uh, I already have one of each of these that I bought individually, but this guy is twenty bucks. This guy is fourteen dollars. So to get both of them for fourteen, it, that's a great a great price. I don't have the ten inch version of these, so I picked them up. Um, I use these a lot on small engines, you know, Brat, Briggs and Strat and stuff like that. And I'm going to be doing a comparison video between these guys and the new 7-in-1 and the part number for the 7-inch and the 4.5-inch squares is uh, Marble Lima Sam Quill. 070 Paul and the part number for the Husky three piece 10 inch uh, quarter inch hex impact socket adapters 1005 Um I hope the information is helpful. I will give you guys my opinions on these later. Um, I'll do a video probably just about the, the squares. And we'll do a separate video, probably comparing these 6-in-1s to the new 7-in-1s. Um, these do 8-gauge to 20-gauge wire, stripping capacity. Um, they ream, bolt cutter, wire stripper, loop maker, wire cutter, and pliers. Plus any other inventive way you can use them. Um, they're nice. $19 instead of $24.97. Uh, so, and then, you know, $2 in tax on each item because there's four items. It was $8 in tax. So, this was $11, $16, $21, and the jacket was $51. Um, I will leave a link to the, the coat if you guys want on the video to act for Acme Tools. Um, and Ohio Power Tools. They might have some deals on them. Um, appreciate you guys watching and hanging out with me today. Uh, appreciate you guys um, stopping by the channel. As always, please like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon for future updates. Go check out my Amazon affiliate links, my Acme Tools affiliate links, my DJI Electronics affiliate links, as well as my Ohio Power Tools affiliate links. And at the very top of the description, I do also have a link to Ulsa Tools um, with my name on it. If you guys uh, find anything over at Ulsa Tools that you like, you know, click on that link. It gives you 10% off your order. Um, and it also helps me out. It kicks me back a availability to get 10% off my next order from Ulsa Tools. And, um, you know, they have great organizational stuff. They have great stuff for sockets and, and pliers, organization of all kinds. They have um, some nice tools, including this uh, half-inch drive split beam torque wrench right here. Um, I, have a, I have the torque screwdriver we'll be doing a video on. Um, all of these uh, sockets are set up with um, also tool rails. Um, as well as I have a crap ton more sockets and some more organizational stuff to do. Appreciate you guys stopping by and hanging out as always. And uh, hopefully I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a great rest of your day. Peace!